I was humiliated and expelled from the castle because I was not born with magical powers. But I found a way. This girl will help me prove to my father that I'm worthy of the throne. I'll take her powers for my own. Detective, I know it's been ages, but I need your help. I've come to the abandoned quarter of a town called Stone Peaks, and I'm afraid something bad might happen. I saw it in my dreams. My faithful dog, Sheriff, will accompany you. Sincerely, Princess. Princess grew up without her mother. She was adopted into the family of a sculptor named Amadeus. During that time, she discovered her magical skills. Princess can bring any statue to life, and in turn, the statues were happy to serve her. Amadeus found a new wife and soon began to forget about his precious princess. After a bad accident in the town where Amadeus lived, Princess left to seek out her real mother. Princess's mother was a powerful sorceress named Selene. Her father was a great elven wizard named Roselian. Nothing about Princess's life seemed destined to be easy. Princess helped Selene and Roselian through a difficult time in their relationship. Now, they live a happy, calm life in this town.
One year ago, at the town festival, I met a wonderful man named Prince. It was a sunny day, and he gave me flowers. Every day at 12 o'clock, we meet in our special place. But one day, Prince sent me a letter asking me to meet him in the abandoned part of a town called Stone Peaks. I had dark dreams about this town. I worry I might be in danger. Luckily, the friendly statues I revived with my powers will always protect me. The gates of the town are near my cave. I will set out to meet Prince. Thank you for your help. Something terrible attacked me, and locked me up. I couldn't see them, or whatever magic they used. If you're headed to the abandoned area of Stone Peaks, be careful. Silly pile of stones. None of you statues can stop me. I will get Princess and carry out my plan. <laughs> 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 